kusoma kwa sababu ni mbongi wa pale yes. na ni kipindi chako cha kwanza hiki kule nilisoma kwenye magazeti kwamba sijafika kule katika maeneo yale kusema kweli sitakuda ndani <laughs> sijai kufika lego soka mimi mwenyewe lakini tulikuwa huko hata juzi eh, 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 eh. tulikuwa na mheshimiwa nasikia kule one time inatosha watu wa Lego Songa hawawezi hata kidogo kukuregesha round 2. Do you know mheshimiwa kwamba from, from 1992? Yes. 1997? Yes. 2002? Yes. 2007? Yes. 2013? Yes. 2017. Mheshimiwa unajua kwamba sasa hivi unahesabu muda tu wa miaka miwili mitatu alafu usahau kabisa ubunge wa Alego Songa. Take this to the bank. I'm going to serve as member of parliament for Alego Songa for, th- for three terms. Because 20 2020 2027 2032 I have to be governor of Sia. 2032 I have to be governor of Sia. All right. So before that so before that because yes. Uh, uh, in the next election 2022 we are going to have a new governor who will serve 10 years okay. i'm going to take over from him okay. uh, or from her okay but uh, i have to be mp for f- uh, 15 years okay. you know the reality is that uh, it's been unfortunate mm. we have been having mp serving one time mm. but nilikuwa i was selling the lango nilikuwa nabia the lango atam atam chana unajua before you get married wewe mm. unatongoza huyu unawacha huyu mm. unawacha mm. sasa ile umepata ule ule msana sasa the one that you can now trust nzuri kabisa sasa unaoa yeye so alego songa has been looking for a, a leader all right uh, a leader who can fit the bill all right and i can tell you i've served for one year mm. if you go to the constituency right now mm. do an opinion poll they will tell you that they are going to reelect me simply because i've been able to understand what they need Okay. They need an MP mm. who is present on the ground. All right. To listen to their issues because representation is very critical. You cannot be a representative and you are not on the ground. Mm. But I have done very well. All right. You need an MP who is national, who is nationalistic. Mm. Who voices the issues of the issues at national platforms. Mm. An MP who is uh, strong enough mm. even to 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 debate in parliament. Mm. You know if you check the history of the MPs that have been removed mm. they have never been close to what, uh, what i'm doing today mm. yeah, and my development program is is, is very clear mm. uh, my people understand my development programs mm. i am close to them i'm available i'm ready mm. and uh, of course i'm one of the few MPs in Nairobi who who are sensible and who are credible who knows what, where the country is going and who can debate nationalistic issues all right you, know, you cannot be able to leave such an MP and Lego Songa is going to elect me three times three times What are the two things ambao unaweza kusema mheshimiwa hadi kufikia sasa since you are elected mpaka leo hii mambo mafanya nini mawili tu ambayo unajivunia sana leo we have uh, uh, in the area of uh, project implementation yes of course you know member of parliament has resources given to him by to him or to her by, by national government yes i have utilized the resources very well uh, initially with there were issues of corruption there were issues where people were not able to access services and uh, and uh, uh, in the office of the MP uh, right now even I'm, I'm I rolled out bursary program mm. the first bursary program where the people on the ground are the ones identifying beneficiaries mm. when i go to your sub location i tell you i want 100 people to get bursary you guys meet as a community and give me the list we that that, that never used to happen then also the quality of work i'm i'm i'm, I'm reorganizing Uh, the school infrastructure in my constituency mm. lego songa is the largest constituency in, in that region okay 115000 voters six wards there are some wards where some, some wards there's a ward that is equivalent to is the same size as uh, garissa no garissa township constituency all right i have a ward with uh, 29000 votes all right there are some mps who have been elected with less than 10000 votes so because of that large number of uh, Uh, the size and the population of, uh, of my voters mm. the resources i have is limited but we are using them very well and we are doing quality programs quality projects that people are doing i'm also in the area of networking i'm also networking uh, thoroughly with the national government mm. to that end we i can say that uh, national government <coughs> programs are being rolled out in makuses in a way that has never been done before like which ones we have the rural electrification program mm. when i joined we were talking about uh, less than 10% uh, electricity coverage in my constituency mm. we are now heading 30% okay can you push to 100% we actually i want to in the next 10 years because in the next 10 years we are going to do it 100% because okay. now we are connecting all market centers we are connecting all health facilities now we are going into homes all right yeah so uh, also water 
All right. I have succeeded in, in uh, winning around uh, 100 million shillings that's going to be used in the mobilization, in the, in the drilling of boreholes in my constituency. Mm. Yeah. Mm. So, plus many other things we are, we, are, we are doing, we are working with NGOs and partners in the uh, uh, refurbishing of health facilities. Mm. Yeah, there are some donors that we are, well, have already come on board. Mm. So we basically, we are looking at the wholesome uh, uh, reorganization of our people's basic uh, needs. You I know, know. I, want to, I, want, I have told them, they know, that I, 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 want, I want to be MP for 15 years, simply because the person who is going to become governor in 2022 must serve 10 years. Yes. But if that person decides to serve five years, then I will take over as governor in 10 years. All right. Yes. All right. So 2032, governor. Sia County. Sia County. Governor Sia County. And it could come earlier based on, on, on who is going to become the next governor in 2022. If, All right. the, if the person who chooses to be governor in 2022 decides to serve one term, then I would obviously take over. In 2027? In 2027. <laughs> 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 